Hi folks, this week it's time for some black label, but we're not talking whiskey. Argentina, Andes and altitude, it can mean only one thing, Malbec, coming right up. Hi guys, welcome to yet another edition of Big On Wine, the show which, uh, as you should know by now, brings you news, clues and reviews about, yes, everything in the world of wine. And my wine of the week for this week is indeed from Argentina, and it's this one here. It's Finca Las Moras Black Label, Malbec, and the vintage is 2016. And this wine comes in for a price where I am uh, for just under uh, 15 euro a bottle, so at a really, really good price. Now this wine here, Finca Las Moras, comes from the city of San Juan, uh, and that's in west central Argentina. Now that's a long, long way from Buenos Aires, about 1200 kilometers or so west of Buenos Aires, tucked up under the Andes, fairly close, about 180 kilometers or so north of Mendoza, which of course is another of those wonderful Argentinian wine centers. Okay, now San Juan is uh, roughly 650 meters above sea level, and they say that the best Malbec comes from an altitude of around 800 to 1,500 meters above sea level, so we're talking high altitude wine here. Okay, the San Juan area is rocky and mountainous. It has a mild winter and a hot summer. Of course, the seasons are the other way around uh, in Argentina. Um, sunny all year round, uh, desert climate, and of course, this wine is harvested in the spring. Now, Malbec has proved to be a great success in Argentina. Now it's originally of course associated with Bordeaux in France. It's one of the big six red grapes that go into Bordeaux, but uh, in recent years it's been more associated with the uh, town of Cahors and the black wine of Cahors, which we reviewed a few weeks ago on the show. Okay, Malbec of course is famous for its robust tannins and also its good structure. It needs sun and heat, and that brings the color and this wonderful plum flavor to the wine. Okay, let's have a look at this one here. Finca Las Moras Black Label, 100% Malbec. A big wine, this is about 14% in terms of alcohol. And we can see that in the glass, it has that very characteristic sort of inky red violet kind of color. So a very, very dark, inky kind of red color in this wine here. Okay, let's see what it's like in the nose. Um, now, in the nose, the perfume on this wine is absolutely fantastic. The Malbec grape, especially from Argentina, is very, very much to my liking. It has a kind of a dark aroma, but fruity, um, very fruity and indeed toasty too. There's kind of earthy notes in there, um, but I'm also picking up um, touches of black currant and plum and maybe even a touch of pepper as well in this one. All right, let's give it a try in the mouth and see what we get. Okay, now in the mouth, First reaction is big tannins, big tannins. Now, they're not over the top, but they are very, very prominent, very much to the fore. Big tannins in this wine, so it delivers what it promises here. I like the big tannic flavor of this. It's um, earthy, um, toasty, velvety, fruity, um, crying out, I think, for good food to go with it. So this isn't a wine, I think, that you're going to sip just a, of an evening in a glass. You need some food to go with this wine, um, but it, it has a wonderful, robust, big flavor, really speaking to me in spades, this wine. All right, let's give it one more try. Okay. 
Yes, indeed, it has that puckering effect in the mouth. Long, long, long finish. Not a great deal of oak coming through, but just a touch in the finish, oaky finish. Um, warm, crying out for food. What kind of food then are we going to put with this? Well, I think what we're looking at here is a wine that's going to be absolutely perfect with dark meat, um, beef, naturally uh, grilled beef would uh, be the perfect Argentinian accompaniment to this, but also I think more generally venison and also elk. So aromatic, uh, strong flavored dark meat. All right, let's bring you the heads up on this one. We're talking here quality Malbec from Argentina at a budget price, and by that I mean under 15 euro a bottle where I'm based. The serving temperature for this wine is around the 18 or 19 degree mark. This is Finca Las Moros Black Label Malbec 2016 is the vintage. I'm going to give this wine four stars plus out of five. OK, guys, many, many thanks for uh, taking the time to check out this week's video and the little introduction to the uh, Finca Las Moros Black Label, a Malbec there from Altitude with a fantastic selection of taste for us. At a good price too. Great stuff. If you've enjoyed what you've seen and heard, then please do feel free to give us that big thumbs up, which we appreciate so much. Uh, share the video around, naturally. Drop a comment down below. We always like to read your comments. Follow me on my other social media platforms. And of course, if you haven't done so already, then you can always uh, hit that big red button up there behind me to subscribe. I'll be back again next week with another great Wine of the Week for you. But until we meet again, this is Tony Melville signing off and saying, hey, take care out there. Be good to each other. Enjoy your wines. And cheers.